Welcome to MathsMaster.org. Let's learn about factors. Choose a number and then the factors of that number are all the whole numbers that divide into your chosen number with no remainders. That might sound a bit complicated, but don't worry, there's actually a really easy way of finding factors and we use factor bugs. So here we go then. We're asked to find the factors of 12. OK, well to start off, do this. Draw yourself a factor bug that looks like this with two big googly eyes and put the number 12 in the middle. Then say to yourself, what two numbers can I times together to make 12? Well, we could do 1 times 12, couldn't we? So put a 1 and a 12 as feet for the factor bug, like you can see here. Are there any other two numbers we can times together to make 12? Yup, what about 2 and 6? So again, 2 and 6 become feet for the factor bug. Are there any more? Yes, there are. 3 times 4 makes 12. So again, you've got 3 and 4 as feet for the factor bug. Are there any more? I can't think of any. There actually aren't any more factors of 12. You actually now have to write out the factors of 12 are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6 and 12. They are just the feet of your factor bugs. OK? OK, let's use a factor bug to find the factors of 18 now. So draw your factor bug as before and put 18 in the middle. And then pairs of numbers which times together to make 18. We could do 1 times 18, 2 times 9, or 3 times 6. There aren't any more than that, so the factors of 18 are now just the feet of our factor bug, which are 1, 2, 3, 6, 9, and 18. Let's do another one now. Let's find the factors of 17. So we draw our factor bug, put 17 in the middle, and then we think of pairs of numbers that times together to make 17. We can do 1 times 17, but actually, that's it. I can't think of 2 times something, 3 times something, 4 times something, and so on, that multiplies together to make 17. Actually, this factor bug has just got two legs. That's okay. The factors of 17 are just 1 and 17. It does only have two factors. And numbers which have just two factors are really special. They're called prime numbers. And that's something that you definitely need to know. So if your factor bug has just two legs, that number has just two factors and we call it a prime number. That lesson was learning about factors. If you want to see some more great maths videos, please visit mathsmaster.org.